Welcome back to Theme Park Wizard and thank you to KTLA. We have some aerial shots of the Fast and Furious project update here at Universal Studios Hollywood. So I know I just did a Fast and Furious update a couple days ago. But yeah, these just came out today. So it's really cool to check out the progress of the project from above. So let's go ahead and start that right now. Let's kind of uh, dive deep into these photos. So here's our first shot, in my opinion, the best shot, because you can see the pillars, of course. We can also see the foundation work here um, onto the right side of the project where those close to the right side of those construction walls where the pathway is. Of course, you can see the two pillars, which will presumably be, be for the obviously the station area, then maybe the load and unload area and see one pillar all the way up to or two more pillars all the way up to the top there, which will probably encompass the launch section, the first launch section for the track. But you can see maybe the beginnings of maybe the foundation for the queue portion of the building, the, the at least the entry queue portion of the building to the right with a lot of foundation work going down there. And a lot of bunch of squares and some, some lines, doing some digging, um, building some trenches and all that good stuff. So that's pretty interesting to watch as well. In this overhead shot, you can see the massive crane that we've been watching, how high and tall it stands above the whole site. And yeah, there's the, again that main station building that they're working on and that big retaining wall. You can see that the station footprint, as we've been noting, and the on the ground on the ground construction updates continues to go all the way outward a little bit where the mountain used to be. They cut part of the mountain and they're gonna extend that flat area and grade it, add some dirt there and grade it to put um the massive station building because that's also where the return track and maintenance bay will be on that side as well. Over on the main tracky hilly side, on the, where all the tracks can go, they can just continue to push away, push away, and go ahead and eventually put some piles in there for the supports and track supports as well. Here's a here's a somewhat blurryish shot, um, not the best quality shot from KTLA, but this shot is of the whole project side coming from the freeway side. You can see the massive dirt patch there right in, right in the middle of the theme park. And there's the 101 freeway over up to the right hand side there. But yeah, this is a pretty, again, a very big site and they're continuing to work and to really get every nook and cranny in, in that space there for this coaster. That will be where the large implement inversion will be coming up towards the creative campus, which is just about open or if not, uh, just about to open if not open already as we saw in the last construction update so yeah just just see how big this massive site is it's pretty incredible and here's a close look from that same angle but it's just a closer look and again that big tower crane there and just a better look at the station and the new retaining wall there's shoring walls uh going up there to extend the station you can see the walls that we've saw from, seen that from the escalator are lining up with those new walls being placed on the ground below. Okay, one big massive uh, foundation area. And this part will take the longest, which is why I think we see a lot of the most work, a lot of the work happening on this section uh, right now, because this will take the longest putting the foundation foundations for the station, building the new walls and all that good stuff. Putting in the track won't take too long. They just need a few supports, a small area for each support, and then just to, you know, <clears throat> take and place all the track pieces together. So that's why you can't, don't really see much work happening on the mountain side there, although there's still plenty of work happening on that side with the placing and drilling of the piles, as, as you can see on the bottom of this picture here. And when that is ready to go, they'll be again placing the supports and the track in a relatively quick manner it's almost like placing legos at that point but a lot of the real intricate work is right here on the station but on the cube it's a multi-level station of course so they have it's like two to maybe three stories um probably only two of them will be accessible by the guests but team members will probably go up to the third floor maybe riding control will be up there so and some mechanics and stuff and then they're getting up the maintenance space so this is a very complex area not only on the mountain but this with the whole project as well the rest is relatively unthemed this will also have some theming elements um to the to to it um we saw on the on the nighttime concept art universe released potential maybe will potentially look like maybe a warehouse kind of like superchargers right now i kind of hope not but we'll see it's very a dark image it was a nighttime photo on purpose because i'm sure universal will release official concept art hopefully soon um, as the project is going to open next year and maybe soft open later this year. We'll have to see on the progress. Yeah, I'm sure 
Universal will hopefully release official concept art soon. But the project looks fantastic and these are actually all the aerial photos that KTLA has given us so far. So awesome that um, they went over and flew over this spot for us. Their studios is just down the freeway on the 101, just a few miles down the road. So I'm glad they are able to give us some bio reconstruct like photos. But what do you guys think of this quick little update for Fast and Furious? I'll be back on the ground next week um, following more more construction progress from this and the upcoming wholesale and all the other Universal Studios Hollywood projects below. Comment below what is your most favorite part of this social? What, uh, what excites you about these images? Do you think these images are pretty cool? Let me know in the comments below. As always, have a fan, um, like this video if you like this. Uh, if you like this video, press the thumbs up button. Subscribe for more updates on this coaster project and more projects from, projects from Universal and theme parks all over the country. As always, have a fantastic day.